which replaces the hated notch on previous models. The pill shaped bar houses several key sensors, including the selfie camera, proximity sensor, and depth detector, which all support the face ID unlocking feature. Unlike the notch, however, Dynamic Island is not a static black obstruction on the screen, but an interactive part of the display. Providing quick access to alerts, notifications and background activities without interrupting the app you are using. While it may seem like a gimmick, I've found this new feature quickly becomes a natural part of how you use the phone, making it much easier to multitask on the device. For example, you can set a timer and then go back to browsing social media while keeping an eye on the countdown clock in Dynamic Island. Or if you're replying to emails while listening to Spotify, you can tap and hold on Dynamic Island to bring up the controls, allowing you to pause or skip a track without leaving the Gmail app. Dimensions 5 81 by 2 81 by 0.31 inches weight, 7.27 ounces display, 6.1 inch, diagonal, OLED chip, A16 Bionic camera, 48 megapixels main, 12 MP ultra wide and 12 megapixels telephoto with 3x optical zoom and 15x digital zoom selfie camera, 12 megapixels connectivity, 5G Wi Fi battery. 23 hours video playback capacity, 128 gigabytes, 256 gigabytes, 512 gigabytes, 1 terabyte colors, space black, gold, silver, deep purple price, £1,099 to £1,649. Depending on storage capacity, while the list of apps that use Dynamic Island is still fairly short, it is likely to grow with the launch of iOS 16.1 later this year, which will introduce live activities. That means you'll be able to check the status of your delivery order, the expected arrival time of your Uber, or the latest football scores with a quick glance. Another major new feature of the iPhone 14 Pro is the always-on display which keeps information on the lock screen visible even when the phone is in standby mode. This is a common feature on many Android phones, as well as the Apple Watch. But it's the first time it's been available on an iPhone. iOS 16 brings the ability to customize the lock screen, so as well as time and date, you can now add widgets showing the weather, battery level and calendar events. Notifications also pop up at the bottom of the lock screen. In a social setting, the always-on display can be distracting. As information is visible even when the phone is lying untouched on a table. But it is useful to be able to glance down and quickly check the time without having to touch the screen. And you can always turn it face down if you don't want it catching your eye. The always-on display is dim enough that it doesn't light up the room while charging on a bedside table at night. And the new power-efficient display engine in Apple's A16 Bionic chip means it has minimal effect on battery life. The long-awaited iPhone 14 Pro and iPhone 14 Pro Max finally went on sale on Friday. With fans around the world eagerly queuing outside Apple stores to be among the first to get their hands on the new device. But some early adopters are already reporting a bizarre problem. The rear camera's main lens physically shakes and rattles when they are taking photos or videos in some third-party apps including Snapchat, TikTok and Instagram. Apple has now confirmed in a statement that it is working on a fix for the bug and will be releasing a software update next week to resolve the issue. It is unclear how widespread the problem is or what the underlying cause is, as the problem does not appear to affect the iPhone's built-in camera app. However, 
Several concerned iPhone 14 Pro users have taken to Reddit and Twitter to describe their experiences and share videos demonstrating the issue. Read more The iPhone 14 Pro also brings a big camera upgrade, with the main camera now sporting a 48-megapixel sensor, up from 12 megapixels on the iPhone 13 Pro. Most users won't notice the difference. However, as the iPhone 14 Pro still defaults to shooting photos in 12-megapixel resolution to avoid clogging up the storage. With its frosted glass back, shiny aluminium band, MagSafe charging and triple lens rear camera, Apple's £1,099 iPhone 14 Pro appears almost identical to its predecessor, the iPhone 13 Pro. When you first take it out of the box, it's only when you switch it on that you realize Apple has made some significant changes to its latest model, most notably a new notification bar at the top of the display, called Dynamic Island.